back to Ash Footy TV. This is a preview for 2015 Grand Final, Hawthorne versus West Coast. Now, these two sides, the way they got to the Grand Final was Hawthorne lost against West Coast back in uh, the first week of the finals, second qualifying final. They lost by 32 points against the West Coast Eagles. They were suffocated by them and they took the long road and the next week they played Adelaide, which they uh, won very comfortably. And then into a preliminary final, they got over the line against the minor premiers in Fremantle. West Coast, on the other hand, won the, the first week of the finals against Hawthorne by 32 points. And that uh, gave them a week off into a preliminary final. Then... The preliminary final was against North Melbourne. North Melbourne started off very well, but West Coast in the second half overran the, the Kangaroos and run out winners by 25 points. These two sides have been the best two teams in the competition this year. Hawthorne averaging 109 points and West Coast 104 Hawthorne have had four players that have kicked over 40 goals, whereas West Coast have only had two. Where and when and the weather for this game? Well, the game is being played at MCG on the Saturday 3rd of October at 2.30pm. And the weather is going to be around about 28 degrees. Who will be missing for this game? The only player that will be missing for this game is Billy Hartung. Jack Gunston comes in for Hawthorne and West Coast have got an unchanged side. This year, these two teams have met before the grand final. In the second qualifying final, Hawthorne lost by 32 points, as I said uh, earlier in the summary. The two Josh Joshes for West Coast kicked three goals each, Josh Kennedy and Josh Hill. And back in round 19, Hawthorne won by 14 points. And that game was being played at Domain Stadium. That night, Sam Mitchell picked up 36 disposals. The five previous meetings before the finals, West Coast have only won one out of five against Hawthorne. Insights for these two teams. Two teams have been the highest scoring in uh, season 2015 in the Premiership uh, standard. Hawthorne averaging 109 points to West Coast 104. Hawthorne Coast. are the best contested team of the two sides. Hawthorne are the best uncontested team of these two sides. So if West Coast can put a lot of pressure as they did in the second qualifying final against Hawthorne, they'll run out winners or Hawthorne will play at their own game if they're allowed and they could uh, potentially win uh, three in a row. The other best uh, insight for these, these two sides is that uh, Mitchell and Prittis, second and third in the brown load this year and they average 28.8 disposals each. So they're... They're the, um, the best matchup, uh, I reckon, for this, for this game. If Sam Mitchell can be held uh, by not only Prittis, but uh, other teammates for West Coast, uh, I reckon Hawthorne will, um, will lose this grand final. Can both teams win this uh, grand final? Hawthorne first. I think uh, if they are allowed to do what they did against Fremantle, and that's their uncontested uh, uh, strategy, game plan, as you, uh, as you would say. If they uh, allowed uh, that style of, uh, style of play at grand final day, I think they'll uh, run out winners. But if West Coast Eagles can uh, suffocate them, put a lot of pressure on the ball carrier, I think uh, West Coast uh, will go a long way of winning this uh, grand final. My tip for this uh, grand final, I think uh, West Coast Eagles by 16 points. 
that is the completion of uh, season 2015 for the preview for the grand final this year. I hope you enjoy the grand final and I'll see you in the off season for 2015 going into 2016. Hope you enjoyed Ash Footy TV this year and I'll see you next time.